hi, yes, hello, and welcome to the channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ashley, and if you're a returner, welcome back. If you haven't seen the title or read the thumbnail, we are watching the final installment, the fifth movie of Pirates of the Caribbean, and it is Dead Men Tell No Tales. Now, I just watched the fourth one yesterday, and we ended with Jack Sparrow and Gibbs walking along the beach, and Jack's like, it's a pirate's life for me. I know they have the black pearl in the bottle, remember? From Blackbeard's ship, we, speaking of Blackbeard, Big Dead disintegrated into a whirlpool of nothing, but his daughter Angelica turns out to be the only person Jack Sparrow has ever truly been in love with. And in the end credit scene, we saw her on the island with Jack's voodoo doll. So I'm excited to see how that's going to come in. I don't remember where we're headed to after this because, you know, last movie was The Fountain of Youth and Gibbs burnt that map and he said it's all in his noggin. So I don't really know where we're headed, where we're starting, where we're going. Uh, Dead Men Tell No Tales makes me a little anxious about Jack Sparrow's life. So I guess the only way we're going to find out, no more diddle dallying, let's get right on into today's movie, which is, oh, by the way, the Marx Brothers. Fun. <laughs> which is the fifth installment, the fifth and final, so far, installment of Pirates of the Caribbean, and that is Dead Men Tell No Tales. <laughs> Pirates flag again on top of Disney? Pirate's flag, yes or no? Yes. Love it. I'm excited. I'm so excited about this one. I'm excited to see how they wrap it up, and I'm excited about it. It's kind of bright, isn't it? <laughs> Okay, still so crazy to me that that's how I learned that lighthouses used to work like. I don't know. I don't know why I thought lighthouses were only <laughs> around after the light bulb was invented. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you about... I really feel like you are making a terrible mistake. It's such a dark movie. I'm having trouble seeing which boat this is. Is this the boat that went over last time or under uh, in the fourth one? Yeah, the Flying Dutchman. Okay, okay. I'm following. I got you. <coughs> Wait a second. Is this Will's kid? Is this Will's kid? I don't like the footsteps. Father? Oh, it's Will's kid? I said I'd find you. Look at me, son. Oh no, Will. Get home to your mother. No. You don't backtalk your daddy. I think I know a way to break your curse. Oh. The trident of Poseidon can break your curse. Oh, the last thing we need to go do is go pissing off an ocean god. I never thought Orlando Bloom could be ugly, but with them crusties. You must let me go. What is that? What is that? What is that? A little necklace? Hey kiddo, I'm gonna need you to untie your foot. I'm gonna need you to untie your foot, buddy. Captain Jack Sparrow. You know what? I'm really excited for this concept. I'm really freaking excited for this concept. What? Oh, a little mirror. Gotta look around. <laughs> Turner! <gasps> so this, this is a grown-up kid. I love that. Okay. You will not address the captain, boy. I know. Bold. Bold. This one is clearly disturbed. And clearly very visually appealing. Big fan. <laughs> One against like 50. You really think you're gonna do this, my guy? This is treason. Why did he rip his coat? Did I feel like that was unnecessary? Jack Sparrow. He's dead. How do you know that? Now, if I remember correctly, and I could be wrong, is this where we were, this triangle place in the first movie? I think so. Oh, the pirate ship is gone. That's no ship, sir. It's a shipwreck. Well, be careful. Y'all gonna be the next one. Oh, Jesus. Is it the Dutchman? Wow. Who is it? Who is this group of people? Who is that? I like the hair. Oh, my God. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, well, you just gave away your location. Zombie pirates? Hey, everybody. You might know my dad. He's the fl he's on the Flying Dutchman. <laughs> Tell that old man to shut up. Why didn't mean kill him? That is half a face. That is half a face. Condemned us to this hell on earth. Oh my heavens. I always leave one man alive to tell the tale. Well, praise God, it's me. <laughs> From Captain Sullivan. Sullivan. Captain Sullivan? You got a little, you got a little triple, buddy. Would you say that to him, please? Ah, oh, he has manners. Dead men tell no tales. Dead men tell no tales. Title line. You know what, y'all? I'm excited about this one. I'm excited about this one. The CGI is incredible. Karina Smith, you're an orphan born of the devil. Well, that's kind of dramatic, don't you think? I confess that I will die before I give up this search. Good job, girl. That while we've been talking, I picked this lock. <laughs> nice. Wow, that is a safe, ain't it? I'm going to be really honest with you that I am 98% sure after seeing this girl in this movie, I used the wrong photo for Pirates of the Car Caribbean 3 thumbnail. No man can ever rob the gold from St. Martin. Oh, well, don't, don't be that cocky. Don't be so sure of yourself. Oh, God, Jack, you okay, baby? You got like 50% of the way there. You got to break in and then leave with the gold. Could someone explain to me as... So why I'm here? We have no idea, baby. You were doing hanky panky in the vault? Sir, I believe that's your wife. <gasps> Scandalous! I've got it! I'm robbing the bank. <laughs> Don't announce that. We're going to take down the whole building, too. Honestly, go big or go home. Oh, we're not taking down the building. We are taking the building with us. Got it. That was not part of the plan. I was going to say, it's what... Well, I was going to mention that you also need to be with it, but got that fixed, too. Look at how much you're losing, though, buddy. Like, you should have shut the door. Oh, well, I guess it's going to good use, so it all works out in the end, huh? <laughs> No dogs, no women. Whoa! That's a giant telescope. No woman's ever handled my Herschel. And we can tell. <laughs> <laughs> you know, something tells me that the pirates don't exactly have the best insurance policy. <clears throat> oh, not the cat! You're a witch. No, just a smart woman. I'll pay you double for selling to a woman. Help! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Crazy. And a pirate! There's a witch and a pirate in my shop! What a big day he's having. I'm not looking for trouble. What a horrible way to live. <laughs> Get her! We're trapped. What do we do? You're never trapped with Jack Sparrow. What? Ah. It's the low clearance during a high-speed chase that'll always get you. <laughs> but now when you're Captain Jack Sparrow... I told y'all you should shut the door. Not Jack keeping the only piece for himself. Am I not the captain of this ship? Yes. You call this a ship? <laughs> Am I not the captain of this shipwreck? Black Pearl has never left me side. Okay, so you haven't figured out how to get her out of a bottle. Not to mention these cannonballs. 18 pounds each, they say. Oh, them some big balls. That's why I walked. Shut up. That's hilarious. Now that is a blatant fabrication. Actually, it's good luck if a bird shits on you. Look it up. Jack Sparrow is no longer our captain. <gasps> My heart. But we've reached the end of the horizon. Even Gibbs? Listen, I'd stand up right now and be like, My captain. Oh, captain, my captain. That's what I would say if I were on that ship right now. What do you want, Jack? You you consult your compass to head in the direction of the thing that you want, but what is it? Uh, 
he wants to sail again. He wants to be the captain of his own ship again. A boy who paddled all the way to St. Martin against the tide on a piece of driftwood. Well, you won't believe what else I gotta tell you. And your sleeves have been ripped. Which means? The mark of treason. Oh, interesting. You speak of the trident. Who are you? A witch! <laughs> You're aware that curses are not supported by science. Neither are ghosts. Oh, I see. To solve the map. No man can read. Left by Poseidon himself. Oh, I need y'all to kiss, and I need to see it happen. But this map has never been seen nor read by any man. Luckily, I'm a woman. Ooh, I love it. She's feisty. So you're saying the map no man can read is hidden in the stars? Oh, I love this. Save your father, you'll have to save me. Find us a ship, and the Trident will be ours. I am so excited for this movie now. I am so excited for this movie. He's gone, sir! Wow. He escaped fast. I've not had a wash in years. <laughs> you know what? For somebody who's constantly intoxicated, he has amazing balance. I spoke too soon. Nice. You would not give up your compass for a silver for for a drink, right? Give me the bottle. You would trade your compass for an entire bottle of rum? Oh no. See, Jack, why would you do that? For rum? What a silly thing you just did. Jack Sparrow has given away the compass. Oh, really? It literally inspired an entire earthquake and now the zombie pirates can come and get him? Wow, look at him. Or what's left of him. We are free! Nice, good job, you guys. Like, Jack, did you know that was gonna happen? Come to daddy. <gasps> and now look, your, your bottle that you traded your compass for has been shot, so you don't even get the alcohol now. I will never set foot in this town again, sir. You know he just introduced his organs to so many bacterias. I don't like the zombie bird. Ah! I don't like the zombie bird! It's so crazy that smart women used to be considered witches. I mean, if I were born back then, I would have nothing to worry about, but it's just like wild to think about it, you know? To release the power of the sea, one must divide. One must divide? Psst, I need to speak with you. You were dressed as the enemy. Nobody's gonna want to talk to you while you're dressed in a red coat. <gasps> I don't have a sword. I'm not a soldier. No weapons. I'm not a soldier. No, it can't be. What? I've spent years searching for this. <laughs> Do we even have a ship? A crew? Well. Pants. <laughs> Do you know how long I've been waiting for this moment? This is why you don't meet your heroes. You're the evil spawn of them two. <laughs> Does mommy ever ask about me? Jack, stop it. Nick, like a giraffe and two of those wonderful- Eyeballs? Eyeballs? There is one thing that can break his curse and free him from the Dutchman. And it's happening right now tonight as y'all are talking. And you could be the one who holds the sea and with it become all that you once were. The great- Not Jack faking sleep because he doesn't want to listen. A message from someone you know named Captain Salazar. Salazar? I thought he said Captain Sullivan. Quite happily, he's dead. Very, very dead. Well, undead, but yes. The trident of Poseidon is your only hope. But can we use the trident for both Jack and Will, though? Or is it like a only good for one use type of thing, you know? And if that's the case, which one do we choose? Barbosa is really living his best life. I love that for him. He has had so many adventures during these movies. You got a gold leg now! Asking ourselves uh, whether our thoughts were absolutely necessary. Come on, we'll spit it out, buddy. <laughs> well, some kind of noise had to stop. It was either them or the people talking. They've been sunk by a captain called Salamander. Samoval. Sullivan. Salazar. That one, there you go. <laughs> and quite possibly out of business. He looks like a skinny version <laughs> of the Cowardly Lion. In that wig? What? I've been expecting you, Captain. That, uh, huh? You'd like some tea. I've never seen 
thick tea. The price of crossing my door is blood, Captain. What? As the dead have taken command of the sea. I'm very scared of her. With a girl and a pearl. The pearl. Uh, sad. Maybe you should retire to the countryside. That's exactly what I would do. If they can't get to the land, I'd stay on the land. Milk and a cow, making cheese. At least be alive. What? How'd you get the compass, girl? How'd she get that? Uncle Jack! Jackie boy! How's it going? We met his dad last movie and now we're meeting his uncle? Here for a beating, but the service is terrible. <laughs> I'm about to be executed on dry land. <laughs> Kevin goes into a bar, orders a beer, and a mop. <laughs> Mention my name, they won't cut your feet off. The feet are the least of the worries for me, personally. Oh, so we, we got a whole bunch of women up in there. How would you like to die, pirate? Hanging? Firing squad? Uh, natural causes, honestly. I love the French. Did you know that they invented mayonnaise? Did they really? You know, I think if I had to choose, I would also choose the guillotine. Guillotine. I said that wrong, I think. Do you really wait until the last moment to save this woman, huh? Bring the basket! Basket? Why? For your head! I killed to be stoned right now. Gets the crowd involved, doesn't it? I killed to be stoned right now. <laughs> oh! Oh no! People really used to gather to watch this stuff. What a crazy time. Final words of Queen Smith. Final words, you gotta hear them. In short, most of you have the mind of a goat. Pardon. Maybe you shouldn't insult them right before you die. My head's about to be lopped off, hence the urgency. <laughs> Did you know that on occasion the neck doesn't actually break, it just hurts? Yeah, and suffocates you slowly. That's why I would choose the guillotine. Kill them both! Yes! Oh my heavens. Okay, here we go. That, it was a plan. And there was an attempt made. No, sir. I'm just a diversion. For who? Fire! <gasps> hey, everybody! <gasps> Stop. God! Yeah. No, it's too scary. It's too scary. I would throw up. <laughs> you really thought that big old man you could just kick him? Yeah. Oh, well, she did. <laughs> yeah, be careful. Be careful. Why don't we? I don't know. Cut her rope or something. <laughs> Okay, cut her rope! Cut her rope! I hate that we started this again. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome, me lady. Oh my god! Bless America! Need controlling back, traitor! <laughs> Jack, shut up. <gasps> now that's pretty thick wood. You expect us to pay you to save you? <laughs> Yeah, because it's Jack Sparrow. <laughs> Whoa, Jack, good job. If I kill a coward, the witch hangs. Two for the price of one. Oh, heavens. <laughs> Unconventional, but works. Captain, you really think we can find the trident? You found everything else so far. What could possibly go wrong, eh? Don't say that, Jack. Prepare to drown! Prepare to drown! <laughs> oh, well, what happened? I mean, the rope thing, but. All right, back on track. Here we go. Hey, she's floating. She's floating. <gasps> That's him. That's him. That's the undead. <clears throat> As captain, you've chosen to sail in this unreasonable direction. Prepare to be boarded, to stand their ground, and show no fear. What? I'ma show fear. Wow. All of a sudden, I know why they call it a poop deck, because I would have shit my pants. Look at that! Oh, 
Oh, see, he's just a hand in a hat. Crazy. Hold point! Oh, heaven! See, you shot him in... Oh, my God. That's what I would do. I would be testing it. I'd be like, okay, how does this work? Every time I tap my sword, one of your men will die. No, please don't. Only I eat. Oh, uh, one down. Oh, I mean, I guess he didn't say one at a time. He just said every time he taps it. I declare you shall have Jack's life by sunrise on the morrow, where you can take me on then. Oh, big words, big promise. I thank you on behalf of the crew. Well, the ones that lived, am I right? Well, hey, you can take what's left of them. He killed like five more people. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, like five. Krakens don't speak. Everyone knows that. <laughs> Tell me what it revealed. And why should I trust you? Why is she so flippy floppy? Why are we tied together in the middle of the sea chasing the same treasure? Tell her who your dad is. There is no map in this map. <laughs> I beg you, please, don't argue with her. It is impossible to argue with her. It doesn't yet exist. She's a witch! Oh my god, not again. Ah, ah, she breaks donkeys. <laughs> what?! There's no donkey! Well then, how do you breed them? Well, when a mommy donkey and a daddy donkey... <laughs> She's really pretty, but I don't know who she is. What are you waiting for? Uh, he doesn't appear to be but Wow, she's really gonna try and call his bluff. Barnacles. Like a thousand knives across your back. Yeah, under the ship, girl. <laughs> Map is there. In the sky. On the tip of your finger? No. <laughs> Blushy. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. She's no witch. But you are. Yeah, so how does this work for you, girl? You're going to read that wall for me, or you will die. What's on the wall? Oh, it's all her star math and stuff. Okay, easy enough. We just sail in that general direction. Got it. Nothing? You call this nothing? You're drunk, and you're sleeping. He does that a lot. I am doing two things at once. <laughs> I'm here for my father, nothing more. Mm. But a bonus is a bonus. I'm not paying you for that. Never say that to a woman. That's hilarious. I had to think about it. That's really funny. Just because you can't see something doesn't mean it's not there. Like the map. Like her feelings for you. Perhaps you and I are closer than you think. You could be a lot closer if you wanted to. The sun is up. It's dawn! It's time for people to die! Precision of our accord ends at sunrise. This be the first light. Honestly, I respect that. I'm just blown away by this CGI and how he's dead and looks like he's floating because of his hair. I love it. I love it, love it. That is what I did. I destroyed dozens of ships. Oh, so he was like a little vigilante. And there's the compass. Make ready! Oh, we're not even gonna let him just die at sea. We go and kill him right then and there. Okay, okay then. It's up to you now, Jack. Jack was the only survivor? Look at a little Jack Sparrow. Look at y'all. The devil's trying. Okay, that CGI was a little spotty, wasn't it? It's a lovely day for a sail, isn't it? Jack always gotta be causing a commotion. You stood there looking like, like a little bird. <laughs> Jack the Sparrow. Wow, I never thought about where Jack got his name from. <laughs> Make a sharp turn, send their boat into the Devil's Triangle, and y'all are fine. You can't turn a ship that fast. Not without help like they did. Wow. Well, now I understand why you can see through some of them. <clears throat> What's all this? A sword to become a captain. Ooh. Oh, and that's all your little hair decorations. Cute. You're filling me with rage. 
If little kid me saw this movie, I would have pooped my britches. There's a ship. So she's saying she's got the map, but she's the only one who can follow it. Yeah, exactly. Eh? There's stars. Don't shine by day. Mm -hmm. And she forgot the donkey. We don't need a donkey. My calculations are precise and true. Listen, she's good at the sciencey stuff. Let her do the sciencey stuff and you focus on pirating. No, no, I'm a horologist. <laughs> More like a uh, horizontally recline. <laughs> and she was always looking at a watch. Mm. I could vouch for that. You had sex with his mom? That whole dialogue was so funny. Right, that's it. Kill them all. What? The dead are still coming to get you. The other dead won't be able to have their revenge. Exactly. Exactly, Jack. I rule pirates this stupid. Yes. So far, yeah. Might I suggest? Anytime. <laughs> no suggestion. Do you not see what's behind us? Well, no, she doesn't have telescopic eyeballs. She can't see that far. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. The men on that ship are looking for Jack. And Jack is on this boat. So I'm going to swim for it. Good for you, girl. Karina, stop that. No, 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 no. Don't stop it. <laughs> Listen not to him. Carry on. Carry on. Not her <laughs> pantaloons. <laughs> oh, Lord, we saw ankles. It was almost finished. I saw her ankles. <laughs> Get out. Get out. <gasps> we had undead birds, and now we have undead sharkies? <laughs> nice. Well, that's not good, is it? <laughs> you men are all alive. <laughs> No, you can <laughs> No, no. What we do? I saw a meme that you can punch a shark in, an, in the nose and it'll stop. It'll go away. Crazy. How do they do this? That's a great question. Oh, oopies. Could you imagine being Johnny Depp and filming this with this, like a green screen or CGI shark? You know what I mean? Like nothing's actually there. Anyways, you know what? This plan has worked out really well with the shark. Oh, Henry, baby. Oh, Henry. Yeah, girl, you just did all that work swimming away just for them to walk on water and get there at the same time you do. <laughs> oh, the whole dry land that... He, he just big died. They're unable to step on land. <laughs> I forgot about that. I forgot about that. <laughs> Who's already on this island? Oh my God, is it the island that Angelica's on? Jack always told me that if anything should ever happen to him, he wanted you to be captain. <laughs> You take the captain's hat. Congratulations. This is the proudest moment of my life. Oh. Well, well, poor guy. Oh, I know what's ailing you, boy. You've got the unscratchable itch. Got a bust a nut. The unscratchable itch. Scabies. I'm talking about scabies. <laughs> oh, no. What is that? Oh, Hangman's Bay. That doesn't sound good. We should tell each other where our treasures are buried, just in case one of us survives. You're not gonna do that. My treasure is buried between two cross palm trees in an unmarked grave in a room. Nice. I haven't got any. Well, damn. I have held our deal. Me men and myself will go ashore. I mean, Barbosa did do exactly what he said he would do, which is take you to Jack. And we know exactly where Jack is, so. Whoa. Are we having church in the skeleton? Where he can settle his debt here and now. W what do you want? He doesn't have any money. Her name is Beatrice. And she's my poor widowed oh. sister. Jack needs to marry Beatrice? Congratulations. It's your wedding day. Oh. This is crazy. Well, honeymoon in the barn. Marriage. No, 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 no. Now, pig. How? Yeah! Yeah! Get into it! Hell yeah, Beatrice! You look lovely on your wedding day. 
Ooh, ooh. What are those things? Crutch goblins. Uh, no, I've got scabies. So do I. Ooh. I believe it, girl. I believe it. Does any man here object to these nuptials? I do. <laughs> you re oh, mm -hmm. yeah, get ready for that one. When I talk about wanting to be an actress, I want to get I want to get the Beatrice part. That's what I want to be, Beatrice. Did you bring me a gift? <laughs> well, well, I've heard of a shotgun wedding. I didn't think this was it. Trade Mr. Sparrow's life in for our own. Well, don't tell the whole plan. You're gonna double cross the dead. Yeah. The pearl trapped in that bottle by Blackbeard five winters ago. That's a sword. Oh, okay. You can do that. Just the ship, not the heart. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Ah. Oh, throw it in the water or something. Pick, toss it real quick. Uh. Now wait just a second. It's shrunken. Maybe you put it in the water. You know, it's like those things when you add water and it expands. Maybe that's what this. It needs to see. Oh, well, th well, what do we do now? I hate this. And the monkey's back. Why are we going away from the land? That's a great question by Jack, honestly. You don't even trust me. We don't trust a woman. Are you giving a foot rub with his feet looking like that? His toenail? I want to throw up. Okay, real talk though, real question. If you were a pirate and you needed to go by the stars, what happens if it's cloudy? What happens if it rains for a couple of days? Do you just get lost? Like, what do you do? I'm glad you can finally see you were wrong. Wrong? She's also right and you were right. Both can be true. I like that shirt you're wearing, Henry. Hmm? Apology accepted. I like them flirting. I love them. Where did you get that from, Missy? My dead dad. No, you're mistaken. Well, there was a ruby on the cover I would not soon forget. Ooh, so it was stolen. He was clearly a man of science. Oh, you monkey! He was clearly a common thief. This diary's my birthright. Her dad's gonna be a pirate, isn't he? I know which stars to follow home. He knows something that I don't know about the stars and Karina, and I need to know it now, please. Her? Are you in love with her? Is that your daughter? It's right on the tip of my tongue. Oh. oh. Or shall I tell you now who what we both know to be true? That's your daughter? Congratulations. I placed the infant in an orphanage, never to see her again. Aww. She's beautiful and smart. She could not be your daughter. 216 mm. barrels of rum. Mm, nice. Reasonable number. You want Jack? Dinner. I want to eat him. I want to eat that man. <gasps> and the trident will be mine. Wow, the plot thickens. I love it. Only the British Empire will hold the power of the sea. How's that going for you so far, buddy? <laughs> wow, it's gotten even worse for you, friend. That's so cool. That's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I feel that, Jack. You know, we could have avoided this if we would have just stayed on dry land. I mean, when in doubt, just take the other person's ship. Oh, you know that hurted. Let's be brave! Save the pearl! I don't know, Gibbs. If I just boarded the boat and I saw this going on, I'd get back on my little lifeboat and I'd be like, I didn't see anything. <laughs> ooh, ooh, no thanks! No thank you! Get your ass back in that boat! Ow. I bet. Oh my heavens. You talk about ringing in your ears that close. Ah. Hmm. Ah. Oh, oh no, they got you. They got you good. Did you find it? Is it there? Ah. Wow, this sucks. For the belly! <laughs> oh, and he snuck away. You can't take your eyes off of him. 
if they can't set foot on land, what does this mean for their ship? Oh, oh, it means they disintegrate. Oh, okay. Henry! Oh, he grabbed Henry. It skedaddled. Just to be here. Is this not the right island? What is this? Diamonds? This is what my father wanted me to find. Rocks. <laughs> Diamonds. This island is a perfect reflection of the heavens. Oh. One star's missing. Quickly. Is the ruby from the book? That's the star that's missing? I think you should know she's a horologist. <laughs> You gotta take that little chunk and put it in there. The missing star. My father. He's right beside you, girl. Okay, this is really cool. This is really cool. Oh. Like, y'all saw it coming. Y'all saw it split in the sea. You didn't have to stand there. Oh. That's so cool! Could you imagine how cool it would be to do that? As you possess the living, there's no coming back. You will be trapped in his body forever. What? We're possessing Henry? Look, Jack, there it is. Now, what makes you think you could just walk up and pluck it out of there? You don't think Poseidon's gonna be a little pissed about this? <laughs> oh, well, he really did possess Henry. Sad, 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 sad. And then his little ghosty friends are just watching him. Did you get him? Why is the sea moving around all of a sudden? Because the because the Triton moved? Henry! There is no Henry. Only Zool. Oh no, is this gonna kill Henry? I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Henry, wake up! He's killing Jack! I mean, Jack almost killed him when he tried to kill the dead man, you know, inside of him. You see what I mean. To release the power of the sea, all must divide. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, the Triton holds all the power, then. Then every curse is held inside. Oh, so break it and everything's good. Surrender to me now, and I'll let you live. This is where the tale ends. Oh, shit. Is he impaled? Slowly being impaled. Oh, the map. Divide. Break. Break the trident and go. Go. We've already. Yes. Right. Correct. We figured that out. Go do the thing. <laughs> now, I mean, I hope that all that water doesn't collapse because then you'll drown. But we'll, we'll worry about one thing at a time. <laughs> oh God! You have to die again. That sucks. <laughs> Hey! Oh, you're coming back to life! Wow! Okay, 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 okay. I see. Uh, y'all better, y'all better go. If the water's closing in, y'all better go. Are you gonna drown for real, for real? Y'all gonna just stand there and die? I haven't said anything in a little while because I'm just, I'm just real stressed and real invested about getting this anchor up. Now, how bad would it be if the plural who? <laughs> the pearl tipped over and got stuck in the water, then they all died. That would suck. Oh no! Other way, other way, other way! <gasps> oh. Alright, good catch, Henry. Your hands will be a little slippery, but I believe it. I've got some. Oh, that wasn't Henry, that's Barbosa. Her dad. Aw, oh, that's sweet. Papa? Who am I to you? Treasure. Aww. That's kind of sweet in a pirate way. <laughs> what happened? Who? Barbosa, you're sacrificing yourself? After you just found your daughter? Wow, really? I have goosebumps. Girl, you just found out so many things and witnessed so many things. You all right? I don't 
no. Hey, Henry, we gotta find your dad. But maybe this isn't the time. She just found hers and then lost hers all in like 10 minutes. So. Barbosa. My name is Barbosa. Aww. Precious. Now, I know this movie ain't gonna end with us not having found Will after the curse is being broken. I know we ain't gonna do that. Well, what you see? The unscratchable itch. Oh. What did you do that for? Just checking it's truly you. <laughs> Although, one. Get into it. Yes. Apology accepted. I love it. They're flirting. It's top notch. The Dutchman. Is it your dad? Ah! Hey, Will. Y'all got so much to catch up on. Aww. The tale of the greatest treasure known to man. That's the tale I want to hear. Ah. Is it Elizabeth? Oh, Elizabeth, you have really let your roots grow out. The last time I saw you, you were a blonde, but get it to a girl. Wow, y'all haven't aged a day. It's been 20 years and y'all have it ish and y'all have it aged a day. Aw, Jack, you could have go had a reunion with your friends and then set sail. What a truly revolting sight. <laughs> Monkey. Forever. Thank you. Maybe y'all can become friends. I have a rendezvous beyond my beloved horizon. I have a rendezvous beyond my beloved horizon. And it's over? Y'all know they just had the craziest sex. You know they did. Who is that? Whose shadow is that? Is that Davy Jones? Oh, absolutely not. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, praise God, it was just a nightmare. Or was it? Really? Well, let us talk about it. Okay. So. Many things happened. I was not ready for Barbos, Barbosa. I think I called him Barbados in the third or fourth one. I don't know. Anyways, I was Barbosa. I had a daughter and then he sacrificed himself. Can we talk about the character development of him from the first movie to now? Like he has made some really selfish decisions. Of course, he's a pirate. It do be like that. But ultimately, he has also made some really good decisions as well. Like... He never just treated his crew awful. Yeah, I mean, except for those times he put them in harm's way. But like, other than, but like, life of a pirate, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, wow. And then Will is back with Elizabeth, and Jack is just gonna follow the stars. There's no map. He's just out being Jack. Okay. Hey, Disney, if you're listening, which you're not, don't make a six one. Let this, let this be it. And you know, people might come for me for this opinion because I didn't like the third one and some of y'all were big upsetty spaghetti about that because y'all were like, the third one in my opinion was the last good one. Hey, and that's fine. That's your opinion. And I love that for you. I didn't like the third one. Fourth one had a lot of fun with the mermaids. That was a really good movie for me. That was a good movie for me. I didn't enjoy the third one. The fourth one, it was a good movie for me. I really liked it. This one, I know it was an obscene amount of CGI, but like, are you kidding me? It was so cool. The From the undead people to the undead birds to the undead sharks? Are you kidding me? I thought it was wonderful. I will say like there was some things that like didn't really make sense. Not didn't make sense, but I don't know. Like the witch... The for real witch with the bald head and the writings and stuff like she was only handy in two parts. How did she get the compass from the bartender? How did she get the compass from the bartender? And I mean. So she's a witch for real because she threw the rat in the cauldron. Into but then she also helped them read the stars. You know, because she went into the jail cell and he was like, you're a witch. What is this? You know, so she just happened to be a very smart scientific witch. 
So there's some holes in that one there. I'm just going to, unless I just missed it, then just like explain that to me in the comments. We have the end credit scene with Angelica and the voodoo doll. So like we could have thrown her into this, but I don't think it's enough to need a sixth movie. I like it here because family's back together and that's cute. Precious love that. The Black Pearl is back together with the crew. Barbosa did pass away, but like he sacrificed himself and now they have like his daughter and blah, blah, blah. And Jack's, Captain Jack Sparrow is back at the helm and like he's onward for more pirate adventures. We don't need a sixth one. I really enjoyed these five with the exception of the third one. And again, we could have, we could, you know what? Let's just blame that on me having a sinus infection. I wasn't feeling very good. Maybe, maybe the movie's fine and I just wasn't feeling good. It is what it is. It do be like that sometimes. So anyways, anyways, Pirates of the Caribbean. I had a great time. Something that I think I wish they would have done differently, kind of, sort of, not really, is I think in the first movie and a little bit in the second movie, I like that Jack made appearances throughout, and I think that's what made his antics so much fun and random and clever, whereas you grew to expect them as the movies went on, like, oh, Jack's gonna do something outrageous and do something that's really, like, it's always just gonna work out for him, you know what I mean, and it I don't know. So that lost its charm. But the fifth movie was very quick witted, fast, like the whole, um, what word did they use? You know, the horror, but or whatever were, you know, like that was quick and funny. And then the guy saying my mom was one, you know, there was a lot quick, funny moments in this one. I thought really quick wit. Um, but I almost think that Jack, I love Jack Sparrow. I love his character. I love his antics and I love his stunts. I just almost wonder if they would have kept Jack not as the main character, but like a like a side main character who kept popping up and got them out of trouble, I just wonder how that would have made the series different. But that's not what we have. Instead, I have watched what we have, and what I have to say is I would rewatch this series. I absolutely would rewatch this series and like you know, I don't know if my brother's watched any of the Pirates of the Caribbean. I would highly recommend this. It's so much fun, in my opinion. Um you got pirates, you got mermaids, you got magic, you got action, you got explosions. Y'all know I love explosions. Mermaids? Did I mention mermaids? I love the mermaids. That was fun. So, since since the third one lacked a little bit for me, I'm going to give the series as a whole four out of five stars just because the third one was like, meh. And I really would hate for them to make a sixth one because, like, this was such a good ending. This was such a good ending. You know... It's okay to be left up for our imagination to think, oh yeah, Jack's still out pirating today, and Will and Elizabeth have their happily ever after, and like, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? So anyways, four out of five stars for the Pirates of the Caribbean five f anthology, five f series, franchise, franchise Fridays. <laughs> we, I loved it. I loved it. I had a great time. Four out of five stars for all of them. I thought this last one was a lot of fun. Very quick wit. I love the CGI special effects. I thought it was so much fun. So that's what I got to say about that. There are two Fridays remaining in March. Instead of putting up on a poll, I think you're going to be excited about this. I know I'm excited about this. I've decided to dip my toes back in the view askew averse which means I will be watching Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back and then Clerks 2 will be wrapping up the final Friday in March so that's what's coming up for Fridays uh for Mondays oh my goodness of course we're rounding out Firefly on Wednesdays this month but Monday the day after St. Patrick's Day we got the Leprechaun that Wednesday Firefly episodes 13 14 and then Monday I'm kind of, I'm gearing up for my birthday trip to Disney. I know there's a giant Avatar ride and I want to be able to enjoy it to its fullest extent. So I'm going to watch Avatar for the first time. That wasn't up on a poll. I just want to watch it and I want to watch it with you. And then we're wrapping up Firefly with Serenity, the movie. So I hope you like, subscribe, stick around. Links to social media down below if you want to be my friend outside the YouTube-verse. And I'll see you right back here on Monday.